Honestly, guys, honestly, waking up to a flat tire, and it's such a beautiful day. Why? Why? Now I gotta see if I can make it to the gas station without like going on the freaking rim. Damn it! What's up guys? It's Jace and I woke up, besides the flat tire situation, I woke up on, on a really positive note. On my IMDB page, they finally updated all my films that I've been in. There's still like three or four that are missing, but they finally updated my, my, uh, my IMDB profile and they have all the movies that I've been in, all the short films I've been in. And it's awesome because now I have kind of like a really good resume showing everything I've done. <coughs> so far guys, I, I must say 2011 has been awesome. I feel like I've, I've like really started moving forward in my life, in my personal life, in my acting life, and in my YouTube life. Everything is just going perfect. You guys are continuing to watch my videos. You guys keep uh, leaving me comments, and I'm sorry I can't reply to all of them because I'm really getting like, it's really becoming crazy, but you guys are still supporting me. And you know, and everything is just, it's just feeling right, you know? I had, uh, you know, some personal issues that I've been dealing with, and, um, and it's working out. I mean, it, you know, I'm, I'm learning how to control it. I'm not letting it get the best of me. And I'm not going to lie, I feel really good. And I feel really positive about this year. I feel like this year is going to be my year. And so far, I mean, it's only January. I've already been to Utah, met with some people over there, went to a screening, made some real important contacts over there. And then in February, I'm off to LA to do some something pretty big. And then, I mean, I can't ask for more, you know. And then on my YouTube, my video views are going up. My subscribers are going up. I mean, everything is just working out the way it's supposed to. And I just feel great about it. And I have to thank you guys because I would never have even started focusing on my career again if it wasn't for you guys. So thank you. So now I got go to, to, to go put some air on the tire. And I'm going to take this, play, this truck somewhere to, to see if somebody can, like, fix the tire or something. Because that tire's always been leaking air. So let's get her done. I'm a little worried I'm not going to make it to the gas station. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's all the way over there at the end. But I can tell that the car's not driving right, man. And it's really starting to bother me. I shouldn't have to be dealing with it. Not to mention the little sign keeps popping up that says tire pressure, you know. This has been going on since the day I bought the car, man. This is already becoming ridiculous. Oh, and there's a tire shop right here. I'm going to get this fixed right quick. Here we are, guys. Getting the work done. All right, guys, we found the spot. We found the problem. All right, guys, so it's obvious what the problem is. It has a nail. I was such an idiot, I should have noticed it. They filled it up with air, but uh, it seems it had a nail. I don't know where it's at right now, but he's going to fix it right now. He's going to fix it right quick for me. So I guess I stepped. It wasn't really the, the, the people's fault. It was actually my fault for uh, running over a nail. But quick, man, 10-minute process. It should be done like in 5, 10 minutes, and then I can head on on the road and get stuff done. Wow, look at that, guys. That was yeah. inside my tire. Yeah. Incredible. All right, guys, mission complete. The sign, it's no longer showing the little thing anymore, which feels awesome. Now I gotta go to the bank really quick to wire some money to my business partner. And then after that, I'm gonna go visit my grandparents and, uh, you know, and visit my family because they haven't seen me like in four days, but the car's driving smooth again. It was that I had stuck a nail on it, man, and it was a weird nail. Like I said, it was like a, like a different type of nail, like a twisted, like it like curved, it, it twisted, you know, it was, it was like a weird nail. It was like, he told me he doesn't know where the hell I drove. I don't know either, but anyways, I hate this. Don't you guys just hate this when uh, there's like a school zone and you gotta slow down and there's like massive, like little traffic and just like a little area slows down everything. Look at this. Gotta go 50 miles an hour and I'm going to 25. Let me slow down. Ah. Uh, All right, guys, so I just came out of the post office, and if it's one thing I hate, is waiting lines. And since my dad's not working today, I got screwed, and I actually have to wait the line. And the worst part about it is they have two tenders, and there's like 50 people in there. So it's like, it's like incredibly crazy, but finally mailed out what I had to mail out, and now I'm heading to my grandparents' house. All right, guys, so we're playing dominoes, and so far my dad's been knocking, knocking on wood. When you knock, it means you don't have any, so. And this is my teammate right here. Ooh, very good. Now I'm going to make him eat his own features. How's it looking, guys? <laughs> oh, they are so uh, stupid. Yes. Uh, so Who's I winning? No. Who's winning? It's, uh, nobody has this one, guys. I don't 
from us. No one has this one on the table. You do. And uh, you big mouth. <laughs> you big, big mouth. <laughs> All right, guys, so I only have one left. My dad has three. My sister has three. And I don't have. Let's see what's going on here. Oh. <laughs> uh, the grandpa. Oh, yeah. What's going on here? Nope. <laughs> and the winner is us. <laughs> Why is there an argument happening among teammates over here? What is what is Poppy doing? He plays for himself. Why? Because you guys are losing a lot, huh? I wanna it seems Jay Saber is a champion of all champions. You ain't no champion. I wanna play. But you ain't winning, are you? I ain't winning, I but you ain't no champion. But who won the last two rounds, girl? All right, guys. So the tables have turned ever since my partner ended up being my cousin. <laughs> we are no longer winning. The old men are winning now, and uh, it's my hand now. My dad thinks he could trick me. Look. <laughs> Pretty. Says full concentration, ladies and gentlemen. This is like the, uh, and he went the other way. I like wonder. He went right? the other way. I wonder why. <laughs> and of course, there he goes to wreck the game. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see what we're gonna play here, guys. Okay, Jace cannot lose. I'm gonna actually show you an entire hand, guys. We're gonna play an entire hand. See if I can do this. Knock, 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 and on. Damn it. <laughs> he, was, he was playing there with his pretend hair. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. No. Nope. Damn. You have everything to wreck my game. <coughs> Nobody has a two, bro. I got trapped in two. Bastard one on camera. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just got home from playing a long game of dominoes. I'm gonna go and knock out. I'm super tired. I'm still feeling a little jet lagged. But whatever. Um, hopefully it goes away by tomorrow. Hopefully I wake up with a lot of energy. Um, I did wake up with a lot of energy today. It just died out little by little as the day went on. I had to drink like three cups of Cuban coffee and it still didn't. Still didn't do anything for me. Anyways, guys, although my cold, my cough has been going away, that I'm pretty happy for. Although, um, anyways, guys, I love you. Thank you for watching. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. It's Chase Haver, the Miami vlogger.